Fans are buzzing. Teams are gliding into position here for the start of the third. They're underway here in the third, and this could come down to last shot wins. 40 minutes into this one here, Razor, how do you see things? Minnesota's got a lead in this game, which is probably a last shot win sort of thing. Man, it's been out of control for two periods. I love it. Huberto's carrying it ahead. Arizona's got control of it now from their own end. Players tell us all the time that they don't know where the next milestone is. That's garbage. They know when they're one goal away from a flat. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. Gains the zone along the right wall. Here's the chance to take advantage with the delay penalty. They've got the extra attacker on the ice. Penalty coming up here. Well, this isn't going to help the comeback, but you can get right back at it. But the penalty killers have to do their job first. killers better be sharp here James I mean you're protecting that one goal lead and now you're shorthanded well things open up for both sides a little bit here with some four on four action doesn't take much for this four on four to turn into chaos one missed shot one rim around the board and it's chaos gets it over to Golodowski Good fight for the puck along the boards. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kepelbienko. Minnesota's got it from behind the net. Orlov's got it through the neutral zone. Arizona's looking to break out of their own end. The Coyotes will have a chance to go to work here on the man advantage after the penalty expired. Shot! Gets a glove on it to keep it out. And he takes the pass. Taken by Orlov. Quick feed to Eriksson Ek. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. From their own end, time winding down here on this power play. They got to get something going here. Yeah, you got to get into the zone first, James. Get it set up, start moving the puck around. But they've got to get into the zone quickly. Moves it quickly over to Line A. Anderson's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Fans have been treated to a fun one tonight. Lots of offense. It's 4-3. And the man advantage fails to pay off as both teams are back at even strength. No, nope, not much they're going to be able to do about that. The power play failed. Now they go back to even strength. Anderson's on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Center's gliding up to the face-off dots here. Bergeron's won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. And now he tries to get it across to Huberto. Arizona's got the puck along the wall. Angles it over to Hayden. The Coyotes played along the boards. Minnesota's got the puck. Sends it over to Kaprizov. 
shot. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Here's a short pass to Bergeron. And that's blocked in traffic. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Arizona stopped control of it now here in the offensive end. Anderson's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Quick pass to Foligno. Here's a chance. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Through center along the wing. Moves it to Beagle. He scores! They tie it up! They stay with it the entire time, Ray! I'm tired of listening to coaches talk about, oh, we follow the process. But the process is you don't get frustrated, you keep chipping away, and you hope to get to this point. Puck is shot and play resumes. Quick feed to Orlov. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. Can't make the connection on the pass. With possession along the wall. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Moves it quickly over to Orlov. Steps into it. And a strong defensive effort to get in front of that. Knocked away by Miller. Gets the puck in deep. The Coyotes scoop it up along the boards. Feeds the puck up to Boyd. Great poke check on the reach. Slides the puck over to Golodowski. Sends it in on the attack. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. Arizona's got it now. Aston Reese carries the puck in his own zone. Minnesota's going on the attack as they gain the zone. And he takes the feed. Comes up with the stop. Both sides digging into that puck along the wall. Pushes it across to Labushkin. Now he takes it over the line. Broken up by Kulikov. And some good footwork to kick it away. Here's a blast! Why? Why? That's an understatement. Minnesota's crossed the line and on the attack. Oh, and he scores! And the deadlock is broken! Well, what a crushing goal to give up. But the other guys worked hard for it. They pressed the play, and now they've got the lead. Minnesota's got an opportunity to try and close things out here in the late stages of this third period. There's still enough time left, though, James, that they have to remain an aggressive team, and their goalie is going to have to make a save or two down the stretch. The Coyotes move it in. The Wild have gained control of the puck along the wall. And a smart hits up play to poke that away by Kovalbianko. The Wild have the puck in the open ice. Well, there's no time to take your foot off the pedal now. This game is tight and is going to go right down to the wire. Focus is important. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. The Blackhawks are next up on the schedule. Some guys will know that. Some guys just leave it until they get through the current game. I, I think it's better to know a little bit about what's coming down the road. Minnesota's won the faceoff deep in their own end. And now it's over to Huberto. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Arizona's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Here's a short pass to Skinner. This is the net, but what an opportunity. Well, he works hard to get into that spot. If you continue to do that, eventually you're going to come through. You'll punch through if you can get to that spot again. Minnesota's game scores! And consecutive goals here, and they're humming. Now they're rolling downhill. They've got the momentum. They're the more aggressive team. They've got a chance to put this away really quickly. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Face-off here on the new 
neutral zone, and we are back underway. Moves it to the middle. Shot. And that's blocked from someone in front. Scrum along the boards. Nice feed. Big chest save as he gobbled that one up with the trapper. his own face off and he wins the draw stop some cold arizona's emptied the net the extra attackers now out on the ice makes the pad save although he might have got a piece of it with his foot and he takes the feed to the empty net and it goes wide now over to hornquist sends it deep inside the offensive zone quick pass to pitlick Minnesota's got it in their own zone. Tosses it on to Polino. Dumps it in. Tries to get the puck over to Rissell. And now he moves it to Line. Aaron pass and they can't connect. A shot. Oh, and he had the answer on that one. Anderson's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Great four check by Boyd. And he makes the save. Centers are set. Face off ready to resume play. Here's a save by Anderson. And that'll close the book on this one as the final horn sounds. Sometimes it doesn't matter if it's close or not. I mean, you look for positives, but a loss is a loss is a loss, and they can't break this streak. They don't need a little luck. They need a miracle right now.